Hey friends, welcome back. And if you're new here, I welcome you. I have a really exciting unboxing that I wanna share with you all. I recently placed my first order for Goose Creek, uh, says America's Best Candles. So this is my very first Goose Creek order that I wanted to bring you all along to unbox with me. I really hope you guys enjoy this unboxing. So let's just get started. So I'm going to flip it around here and here on the front you just have, I just have my tracking information and some items that I did order. I don't like that they display that on the box. Um, people are nosy everywhere so, especially the mail carriers. <laughs> I placed this order on the 26th and it looks like this arrived two days ago. So I've been busy with the BBW Candle Day haul or whatnot. So this box has been sitting around for the last two days. So I finally got some time to get this unboxed for you all. And let's see what we got. So the first thing that I ordered was a hand cream and this is in the scent Marshmallow Waffle Cone and it's 3.4 fluid ounces there. And as you can see the picture of a waffle ice cream picture. <laughs> I'm not sure what type of ice cream that is, but I'm assuming it's something marshmallowy, maybe caramel, I'm not sure. So let's see if they have the notes. The fragrance notes are fluffy marshmallow, warm vanilla bean, dipped waffle cones. Uh, it says it's fast absorbing, non-greasy formula, rich moisture to deeply hydrate the skin and leave hands soft, smooth, and del delicately fragranced. <laughs> So it says this is like a country fair style waffle cone made fresh and filled with homemade vanilla bean ice cream. So, okay, that's what the ice cream flavor is, is the vanilla bean ice cream. So I'm going to give it a sniff. And actually, this is wrapped. It's got that seal on it. So I'm just going to pop that off real quick. As you can see, here's the top here. So I'm just going to put a little bit on my hand. And it's a white uh, lotion. And it feels very hydrating. And uh, I don't like the scent. I don't like that scent. It doesn't smell like a marshmallow vanilla bean ice cream. Um... Yeah, and I have some on my hands here. I don't like that scent. It doesn't smell like vanilla bean ice cream. Actually, it has like a, like no joke. It almost smells like uh, expired. This is really disappointing. Um, Guys, comment down below if you've ever tried Goose Creek hand creams. Um... I don't know, maybe mine's is just possibly expired because it does smell expired. Um, it doesn't smell sweet at all. I don't even get a vanilla bean note from this. It almost smells unfragranced. Um, it is very hydrating and moisturizing. I do like the formula. As you can see on my hands here, it is very hydrating. Um, I do like the formula, but I just don't like the scent. So, um, I don't know. I'm quite disappointed with this one because it doesn't smell very good to me. So, I'm just going to move right along. So, I only ordered one of their hand creams. The rest are candles. So, very excited about these. My hands are kind of slippery, so I've got to be careful. Okay, so the first candle I decided to pick up is the Waffles and Ice Cream. And that's just a front sticker there, as you can see. It just has some waffles with a scoop of ice cream and some fruit on top. It looks like a, a breakfast type design. And as you can see, let me pop 
the lid off. These lids are on here pretty tight, so that's a good thing. Let's see if I can get this off. There we go. I'm sorry, I had some lotion on my hand, so it's all messy now. And here's that white wax. And let's see if they have the sit notes. So no sit notes at the bottom, but before even popping the top off, I could smell this one. This one is very fragrant. So I'm gonna sniff the actual top. Oh yeah, I get a nice waffle syrupy scent. It does smell really good, so. I'm happy about that. Let me bring it a little bit closer. So here's that pick again, and I'm gonna sniff it. It smells like vanilla bean. I get the waffles, and I definitely get a hint of like maybe maple syrup. So this one smells good on cold. I'm really pleased with the scent for waffles and ice cream. Um, I'm really hoping this one throws well because on cold, this smells pretty strong. And the predominant note that I get on cold is that waffly maple syrupy type scent. So hopefully I will detect more of the vanilla ice cream. So I'm really glad that I picked this up. I will do a review on this here soon. I also picked up an aromatherapy candle, and this is in the scent Jasmine and Vetiver. And I was just trying something new, um, wanting to branch out more into trying florals and um, woody type scents. So here's that jar design here, and it is a wraparound sticker design. And no scent notes on the bottom so i'm going to try to pop this top off here we go okay and this one does smell floral the jasmine is the predominant note it's very soft and i do get the woodiness of that vetiver that vetiver it has like a bite to it um it would have been nice if it had more of a sandalwood blend, maybe jasmine and sandalwood, but this vetiver note is really strong. <laughs> and um, let me just set it down here. I do like that the jasmine is more of the predominant note for sure, but I just, I'm not crazy about that vetiver um, note in there. It's really strong and slightly woody. So I'm really hoping that this burns really well and it's a nice blend. I'm hoping I get more of the jasmine because the jasmine just really softens that vetiver out, but I still smell that vetiver. So um, here's the wax color. And what's the size on this jar? This is a 16 ounce jar. So you're gonna get about 60 hours of burn time. So it doesn't smell bad, but um, on cold, it's not my favorite. So I definitely will have a review on this one also soon. And I don't know if I showed you all the burn time for this one. It's 50 hours on the 14.5 ounce jars. So just 10 hours less burn time than their aromatherapy larger jar. Okay, so one of the tops popped off of one of the, I picked up another waffles and ice cream, and that's that there. And lastly, this one's wrapped in plastic. So this one is Goose Creek, France, World Traveler collection and this is the sugared pralines and I do like the actual design you've got the design of Paris there in the Eiffel Tower very beautiful it's a wraparound design this is really pretty I like that and here's the top here have some type of design geometric design going on there so let's give it a sniff 
Ooh, I do like this one. I like this one a lot. Ah, uh, I should have ordered more of this one. This one's sugared pralines. It smells amazing. It's not too sugary. I get the, let me give it another sniff. Oh, this is almost like uh, candy sweet. It smells like candied praline. So if you've ever been in like a candied shop, um, it smells like the candied pralines that uh, we find like during festivals or during the holidays. It's sugary sweet. Oh man, and this is very, it's very soft. I don't smell any caramel. It smells sugary, creamy, like a candied, creamy praline. I really love this one. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. Okay, so you've got 60 hours of burn time on this one, and this one is 16 ounces as well. So guys, that's everything that I ordered from Goose Creek. So I am very excited to get these burned and reviewed. Um, not <laughs> interested in the hand cream unless, you know, I may try a different scent, but that smells very weird and um, just not appealing to the senses. Um, I do enjoy the scent of the waffles and ice cream. It smells exactly how I would expect waffles and ice cream to smell. It's not super overpowering. Um, it's not like a pie scent, but just a nice creamy waffle maple syrup type uh, note. And I do get the vanilla bean in there as well. So I'm really hoping I get a really good throw and a nice blend of all those notes for the waffles and ice cream. And um, as for the aromatherapy one, Jasmine and Bedivir, I'm going to get this burned. It says it's a soothing blend. So hopefully I get a great blend of both of those notes. I mentioned that I'm not crazy about the vetiver notes because it does have like a strong bite to it. Um, I do prefer more of the jasmine, so we'll see how that one performs. But this one here, the France World Traveler and the Sugared Pralines, I will be ordering more of these. I know I haven't even burned it yet, but on cold, it smells phenomenal. It's something that I definitely would love to smell while burning, so... I really hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. These items were purchased during their Black Friday sale. So these candles ran about, I think about $11 and some change. The hand cream was actually two bucks and some change, I believe. So this order cost me no more than 60 bucks. So I thought it was a really good deal and a perfect time to try out Goose Creek's candles so leave me some comments down below if you guys have tried their candle selections what are some of your favorite scents um, I'm definitely interested in knowing also be sure to turn on your notification bell so you're notified every time I upload and be sure to subscribe guys and I will talk to you in my next review bye